YouTube, I'm back. Um, I'm doing a review today about lipsticks, the LA Sparkle Lipstick by, um, by LA Cosmetics. I think that's what they're called. LA Girl. LA Girl. I'm sorry. This is my first products by the company. I purchased them through Beauty Joint. These were not expensive. And they come from this attempt of mine to predict who's going to be the next NYX company before before the prices go up. So NYX have gone up slightly and they're not as cheap as they used to. You no longer can get a lipstick for a dollar and I'm just trying to experiment with different ones. And there really are some interesting companies out there worth trying. Um, the lipsticks, again, from Beauty Joint, I get them in a big package. I get some other stuff when I get this stuff because I ship abroad and I want to make my purchase worthwhile. I don't go overboard too much because over the $75, I have to pay customs. And if you live outside the United States, you know what I mean. Most companies, most uh, countries, it's $50. Here, it's $75. They've raised it recently. Okay, so I got four colors and I got... A red lipstick, a kind of dark brown, a very neutral brown, and a nice pink color. And uh, <laughs> I really, really, really like these lipsticks. The first thing I'm going to point out is they all kind of have a shimmer to them, you know. And I guess what's, what that's what they mean when they talk about sparkles. And I'm going to show you the colors and from top to bottom from top to bottom. The top one is Chianti and that's the dark red and then the next one is Paradise and that's this pink. The dark brown is Chili and the last one I can't see the name but I know it's called Honey because that's what I'm wearing right now and Honey really is just a wonderful wonderful neutral color if you're looking for. the Even the red is a really nice kind of dark brownish red but not too dark. They don't give you such heavy coverage but they definitely give you that shimmer and glimmer. And even if you have a bunch of reds already, the red colors will really add a nice collection to your... They will really be a nice addition to your collection. Now, I have to point out what I really like about these lipsticks. As you'll find out when you watch my videos more and more, and as I make them more and more, uh, one of the things that is a really big deal for me is smells. Like... Um, there's certain things which I'd rather not have smells at all, and I'd rather something not have a smell at all rather than a pukey, disgusting smell. And not on my my English channel, but on my other channel, I've spoken about this lip gloss that I got, and I just think it's disgusting. Can't stand the smell, but on these, the smell. Oh, it's it's like it's like um. Sherbet ice cream type of smell. It's, it's a sweet smell. It's very fruity. It's not the typical. It's not like NYX. It's a little bit. It's different. I've never smelled it on, on lipsticks to smell before. Um, and I really like it. It's a really nice sweet. You can kind of smell it come off of your lips all day long. And I really like the smell. I just can't get over how nice the smell is. The packaging is also nice. What I like about it. And uh, I'm slightly pulling this apart. The other thing that I'm really keen about when I get lipsticks is how how much the uh, packaging says clothes. And the reason is, is because I throw lipsticks in my purse, like a bunch of them, and they eventually get opened, but, you know, and once, once a, when a blue moon I go and I collect them again and put them all in their places and then again start throwing in lipsticks as I go along. But uh, it's always important to me to see that the packaging is stays pretty close. So this does a pretty good job. I wouldn't say that it's the best lipstick closing, but again, for the price that you're getting these lipsticks, it's worthwhile. The reason you want, by the way, your lipsticks to stay closed is because if it opens, I don't know what I put in my purse, but I'm sure that you know what I mean. Things end up in there. I'm not quite sure what. Um, the packaging is nice. It's a nice sleek kind of packaging. Have a little symbol. The LA symbol. LA girl. It's a nice pinkish color and then they have like this um, swirl on the top here that's the same color and you have the color uh, visible through this little window. The name and numbers are on the bottom. Pretty standard. I don't know if it's focusing. Oh, it doesn't want to focus. I'm so sorry. It usually does a better job than that. Oh, I'm sorry. But you can see what I'm, I mean. And 
one of the things that I like, listen, if you store your lipsticks lying down, then this is not a big deal. But if you're like me and you store them, I think most people do this, they store the lipstick standing up. You don't always remember what name you're looking for. You're kind of looking by color. So if you're looking for all your lipsticks and they're all standing up like this, even if you have the color and number showing, you have no idea what the color is. So that's a disadvantage as far as I'm concerned in terms of storage. But the price is wonderful. I'll put the link in below. I'll add the price up here in a little cube. And I all know I'm really happy about these. I mean, you can't beat this. And the smell, the smell is so fun. It's such a fun smell. Oh, I really like this. And I really, really, really recommend the honey color. Because I know that uh, the colors that we really are missing are like the, the more natural. And I really like this color. It's just such a nice simple brown with just a little bit of sheen to it wonderful color definitely recommend go for these i approve 